Hello everyone, and welcome to this month's adult take-home craft. Today, we will be creating some canvas stitch art. The provided craft kit has a 6-inch square canvas, two different colored skeins of yarn, a needle, and a design template. For other supplies, you will need a pencil or pen, some tape, and a pair of scissors. To start, we're going to flip the canvas over and insert the template. Then, take a pen or pencil and trace an outline of the leaf on the underside of the canvas. Remove the template once you're finished. Then, take the needle and poke holes in each corner of the outline from the back of the canvas. Afterwards, we're going to make more holes in the canvas along the trace lines. We want to poke holes vertically, so the yarn will be in straight lines when we thread it through. You can use the back of the canvas as a guide if you want, or draw your own lines on the back. Additionally, make sure to leave a bit of space between each hole, otherwise you may tear the canvas. Once you've poked all the holes, it's now time to thread the needle. If you don't have a needle threader with you, you can use a bit of tape at the end of the yarn to make it flat. Trim the tape down with scissors so it will slip through the eye. Once the needle is threaded, you can just trim off the tape. Starting near the bottom of the back of the canvas, pull the needle through to the other side through a pre-made hole. Then, pull one end of the yarn through. To make sure the yarn doesn't pull completely through, tie the other end of the yarn into a knot. Then, pull the yarn all the way through until it's snug against the back. Don't pull too hard, otherwise you might rip the canvas. Thread the yarn through the hole above it on the front of the canvas. When you reach the back, thread it through the adjacent hole and repeat this step until the section is filled. If the yarn gets tangled, take a few moments to untangle it before you continue pulling the yarn through. If you pull it too hard while it's tangled, it could tear either the yarn or the canvas. Once you reach the end of the section, travel along the back of the canvas diagonally to the next section you wish to fill. Poke the needle through the back of the canvas and start the process all over again. Repeat these steps until you've reached the top of the leaf. 
Now that we're finished with the first color of yarn, tie a knot at the top of the yarn and make sure it's as close to the canvas as possible to keep the yarn taut. Then, trim off the spare yarn with your scissors. Repeat these steps with the other color of yarn and tie off that piece too. Then your canvas is finished. Make sure to pick up your craft kit while supply lasts. They're in limited supply and first come first serve. Stay tuned for next month's take home craft.